Hi guys. Uh, we continue read. We continue reading. We keep on reading uh, in different languages. We we'll read John three sixteen. Uh, and now we will read in Swedish my favorite Germanic language. Okay, I try to read, but it's very interesting intonation. I may uh... okay. Um, let's read. Så älskade Gud världen att ha gav sin enfödde son för att ha var och en som tror på honom inte ska gå förlorat utan ha evigt liv. Okay. And then you, you may listen to it. Google will say it for you. <laughs> Så älskade Gud världen att han gav sin enfödde son för att var och en som tror på honom inte ska gå förlorad utan ha evigt liv. Okay. Så älskade mm. So so loved the the means id <laughs> uh, tense uh, past tense mark marker uh, so else the good so loved God well then um, so uh, God so loved the world uh, and means uh, means the article uh, as far as I can remember the different article uh, in different article is before the web uh, the word at hand gives in this son that he gave his n means one further i think it's born uh only begotten son for at var of en som tro på honom uh for for that so that var every ok and some and one some who do uh, believe uh, in him in this go for law uh, not will will not go uh, perish, die, I don't know. Lord. Should not perish, will not perish. It done, but. Ah, having lived. Have. Everlasting life, eternal life. Okay, you may ask me some questions about different languages, about Swedish, about Bible and religion, about music. You may correct my pronunciation below the video. And you may. Uh, do everything you want. <laughs> you may ask me every uh, 
uh, what whatever question you want. Uh, okay, see you next time. Bye.